contestants. After today, one of you will be crowned the ultimate Slop Popper fan and will appear on the cover of Sloppy Seconds magazine. So, who's it gonna be, Popper King Cleave 42? Yay! Or is it True Popper King 33? Bring him on! I'm gonna slop the floor with this chump! You're True Popper King 33? You're just a kid. I thought 33 would be your age. No, it's the number of times I had sex with your mom. Bro, oh, she's an adult. I'm sure she had her reasons. Now to quote our award-winning 1986 ad campaign, let's stop talking and slop popping. First up, slop culture trivia. Our founder, Miller N. Green, created the slop popper after being fired from what field? Foreskin restoration. restoration. You're both correct. The year was 1968. Bobby Kennedy is slain. A nation mourns. What kind of slop popper did Walter Cronkite have in his lap? Groovy gravy flavor. Correct. The year was 1994. Courtney Love was eating a slop popper when she found the body of Kurt Cobain. What flavor was she? Crunchy gravy flavor. I don't remember the 90s. And now it all comes down to the excellency round. Stop this madness. Slop popper creator Miller and Green. That's right. What the hell is going on here? We're competing to determine who's the biggest slop popper fan. What? My God, he's just a child. An overweight child. And you, you're just a slob. A fat slob with a mustache full of cheese. A cheese product. I don't want either of you associated with my company. But I'm your most loyal customer. I eat five slop poppers a day. As do I, also, too, as well. Five a day? How are you alive? Slop poppers were meant to be a rare treat. A delicate reward for a bridge well built, a channel well swum, or a foreskin well restored. You both made me sick. You have left me no choice. Shut down production on all slop poppers. Permanently! You heard the old man's rash decision? Close down the billion dollar business. We destroyed the thing we love the most. And I stole $2,200 from your bank account and registered you as a sex offender in nine states. Then I shall move to France, like that Oscar-winning child rapist, Roman Polanski. Au revoir.